Every day at more than 50 renewable power sites across the nation, field technicians take action to protect wildlife and preserve habitat. It's all part of Iberdrola Renewables' legacy of caring. The Klondike Wind Farms encompass four individual wind power projects located near the town of Wasco in Central Oregon. Together, these wind projects generate a total of 400 megawatts of wind energy, enough to power more than 115,000 homes. While the project spans thousands of acres of private land, the actual footprint is less than 2% of the total area. Landowners continue to use the remainder for wheat farming and ranching. Here at Klondike, wildlife and habitat conservation are as important as leading the transformation to a competitive, clean energy future. Recently, environmental coordinator Sean Bertrand was awarded for his exemplary service, carrying out Iberdrola Renewables' innovative, first in the industry, avian and bat protection policy. My primary job here is operations and maintenance with my collateral duty being avian and bat. Here we have a strict environmental policy. The award I recently won was based on my work in the year 2013 as acting environmental coordinator at Klondike Wind Plant. As an employee of the company to be able to be recognized for doing my job correctly and diligently and also as an outdoorsman, it made me pretty proud to be transparent and keep track of what's going on in real world data with our plant. It's very gratifying to be able to track it at home and be passionate about it, but being able to do it as a career and as part of my job is very rewarding as well. Sean is excellent. Um, as an avid outdoorsman and uh, hunter, he is very in tune with his backyard and, and he enjoys it, he's so passionate about it that uh, he, he goes above and beyond what we've asked him to do just because he's so passionate. So it's excellent to have him. What we try to train them to do is to be the eyes and the ears of the program. Not that we're trying to turn our wind techs into, into biologists, but we, we try to train them enough so they have the awareness to look up and what to look for. And we, we train them how you know to tell the difference between um, how the, the wings flap and, and the colorations and sizes. and, and being outdoorsmen, for the most part, these guys are, they know more than, than half of us in the office. So it's great, they, they take to it very easily. The data gathering is very important to us. By having this program, we're able to, to, to really prove what our impact is of operating wind plants, you know, birds and bats. We're able to base, base our decisions on what we need to do if after adaptive management is needed because we have this data. Being an avid outdoorsman, I believe we are the original conservationists. It's up to us to manage and take care of these resources to ensure they're here for future generations to enjoy. <laughs>